Welcome! You ready to have a great day? Yeah! Let's go! Good morning! Good morning, Gaitri. <laughs> Eagle Ridge Academy has awesome students. Eagle Ridge Academy is really challenging, and I have many good friends, and many nice teachers who are there to help me and support me. Who wants to read the first sentence in Latin? They come to school every day excited to learn, and in turn that makes me excited to teach them. What we hope we have prepared them to be is an exemplary citizen. That really encompasses everything that we talk about in our pillars. Citizenship, integrity, perseverance, honor, excellence, and respect. Nice to see you today. The pillars at Eagle Ridge are really a framework for building character or building virtue. It's about being a good person, a good citizen. How many planes? Let's start there. Go. How many planes? Three adjectives. The trivium kind of denotes the different divisions within learning. So you have the school of grammar, which is the foundational learning, where we want kids to, to gain as much knowledge as they possibly can uh, before they move into another uh, level of schooling. And they're 25 cents a pop. In our School of Grammar, they've been prepped with all of the memorization and understanding the facts. And then in the School of Logic, they really start to question things. So wait a second though, because I think that what both of you are saying is that there's honor and respect. And whether it's through happiness, happiness for your life, they all came to meet him at the city, didn't they? We're reading through um, the children's homer right now. And I disagree with Kaya because, I mean, think about it. But the literature that we've read, that we die, read here, the history that we teach, it has to the test of time. Would you rather have... By sort of adapting to these principles and finding them in your life, that you can go out into the world and be that person and you can contribute positively and, and take place in the great discussion. We want them to become lifelong learners and to always be in pursuit of wisdom. There's a really great education that we get. I mean, I know that sounds kind of nerdy, but uh, you know, it's just every day it feels like I actually have learned something that's you know, interesting and also our teachers always work really hard to get us to think about you know, the bigger picture. What we're doing is something that's been around for over 2,000 years and that's providing students with the high quality direct instruction at the younger grades and as they develop, as they mature, is to let them slowly start to participate more um, in debate, in dialectic conversation. How does this idea or the role of influence, once we build on that logical reasoning and the asking of the why, when students get to the School of Rhetoric in ninth through 12th grade, they're able to dive even deeper into critical thinking and analyzing by looking at the morals, ethics, and philosophy behind those basic facts and the why to then be able to speak articulately or write beautifully about various topics. The way you articulate yourself is really important because your choice of words can be, can change what you mean to say. It's about inspiring students to become better thinkers um, and better versions of themselves. The greatest thing about classical education is that it actually focuses on art. Three, one, then ready, go. We teach uh, truth, beauty, and goodness, and what's more beautiful than playing an instrument or singing or learning the history behind those things. Uh, the thing that I love most about the school is probably the teachers. They're just awesome and they're really kind and thoughtful. Following the pillars really helps us become better humans. The older I get, the more I realize how those classes and that content that I had in those classes, those relationships that I had, all of those fit together in, in lots of different aspects of my life that I wouldn't have expected uh, as a 17-year-old. 
Eagle Academy has been growing leaps and bounds over 800% since 2004-2005. We have a waiting list of over 700 students without marketing. There is a strong desire to come to Eagle Ridge Academy. We needed to develop a plan to grow our enrollment to help meet the needs of our families and our students right now. And so we put together a mandate that said we'll grow to between 12 and 1600 students by the year 2024. We're not building to get a new building, we're building to meet the mission. It's about offering more you know, academic choices for students. We will have the opportunity to expand twice the enrollment in our kindergarten, first and second grades. Third and fourth grade will see an additional section. And as those children move through the schools, then that will increase enrollment. And so it's really fine tuning what we do because we're in a better space. They are more challenged and how they are trained here by the teachers is to reach the potential of a student uh, in not only one subject, every subject. When I stepped into the college world, I had already kind of been there for a while. Our pillars, perseverance, you know, everything like that just teaches you that you never give up. You really got to keep going. The school has just prepped me um, for life. That's simply what it is, not just college, just for life in general. I know when I'm in college that I will like, if I have a test, I know that I should just do my best because I have learned a lot of stuff in school and I will try to do my best and just be happy that I know I can't do it.